Here's an, another example from Dr. Neil Anderson's research where he's working with cherry and making some grafts to different rootstocks. So the upper part is a desirable cherry. And here's the rootstock. And you see it's been excavated and you can see the graft union very clearly here. The, the root, or actually this is actually part of the stem that's below the soil uh, and is part of the rootstock. So one of the things that might not be clear in the uh, lecture material is that the rootstock actually has a small bit of stem still attached before the root proper area actually starts. And so the graft is made from the rootstock stem, if you will, to the cyan stem. Well anyway, so here's the rootstock, the stem part of the rootstock. You can see it's nice and thick, and this would be the graft union. Now what I particularly wanted to show you here is that you can get some sprouting from this stem area, because it has nodes and inner nodes still. You can get some sprouting from the stem area uh, of of shoots that if they were left to grow up would represent the rootstock genotype rather than the desirable cyan genotype. And so these always have to be trimmed off. One of the desirable characteristics of a rootstock then would be the tendency to not send these up. But as Neil says, that's unlikely because the rootstock's going to want to do what, uh, what rootstocks do and send up shoots. Here's an example of a, a dead one where the cyan has died, perhaps because of winter kill, but we have all kinds of shoots starting to come up from the rootstock. And you might see this in your landscape where perhaps in your yard a tree might die, uh, but all kinds of uh, uh, material comes up, shoot, new shoots come up, and you may be wondering, well, if I just let those grow, is it going to be okay? Well, if it's growing from below, here's the graft union. If it's growing from below the graft union, then no, because you're only going to get the genotype of the rootstock, which isn't what you want. If it's shoots that are coming from above the graft union, you're okay. But more often than not, they come from the rootstock, which is still alive. And so you've lost the cyan genotype and you've lost the value of the plant. You might as well dig it out.